Hi, I'm just about to watch uh, the trailer of um, Trans America before I give the back the video like nine days later. But uh, I just, tears came to my eyes a minute ago uh, when I was watching the last trailer. Uh, I watched it in German. And um, God, it really hits me, really hits me hard, this film. So I'm just going to play it again. I'll do it in English, obviously. Um, hope this is all right to do if it's not please somebody correct me and tell me this is copyright material blah 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 but i think it's actually necessary for people to hear what the trailer is if they've never heard it as well okay here we go Bree was ready to change her looks medical procedures today the usual electrolysis three years of hormone therapy and a fish of feminization surgery and ready to change her life after my operation i will be a woman but the one thing no one can change is the past i got a phone call last night he claimed to be stanley's son not their person my son you told me wilkins jesus the reformer that's one of these churches that sends missionaries out. No. I'm from the Church of the Potential Father. Thank you for bailing me out. Well, got a flight to Los Angeles first thing in the morning. We'll see you out there. Free ride, free food, free motel rooms. I promise to take him to Los Angeles. <gasps> dude, this is great. I wish you would stop calling me dude. <laughs> Eating vegetables. You know, I want to use a fork. Just an idea. Get in here before your neighbors see you. They say your parents are dead. What's she thinking? Your mother and I both love you. But we don't respect you. A story of two people and the one secret that has kept them apart for 17 years. She is not my mother. She's not even a real woman. <laughs> Because a person doesn't go around blabbing her entire biological history doesn't make her a liar. Hey, look. You boys go ahead. Come on. Tony, Tony. Are you a boy or a girl? I can't handle this. Felicity Huffman. There's things about her she's not telling you. Every woman has a right to a little mystery. Oh. Trans America. Let's go. No. <laughs> I don't really have any chance. Hey, help me. Well, that's just a brilliant film, and it absolutely is a brilliant film. I, did, I don't want to give it back. I want to buy it. Uh, I think it should be in my video library, definitely. It's just absolutely incredible. And I heard from my girlfriend, she said she read a review about it. Yeah, because it does actually upset me, you know? It upsets me the fact that people can't actually be themselves. That they have to change from one sex to the other or they won't be accepted. You know, there, there's there's a hell of a lot of uh, in-the-middle sexes, basically. Do you know what I mean? And there's a lot of people changing their sex, right? Um, because, you know, they feel more male or more female. And actually, I feel totally in the middle. Um... And I mean, even the transsexuals don't actually even uh, totally get me, you know, they're thinking, look, where is your female side, you know what I mean, all that sort of stuff. It's not about female side and male side. It's about, like, um, it's honestly just about us being ourselves um, and, and not allowing um, the old traditional stereotypes uh, restrict us from being ourselves. Uh, that's the fact of the matter, you know, uh, I, I don't actually think it's, it's, it's necessary, I don't know the word, the right words to say here, but I'm going to explain this again in the future, but I, I do want to get across the, my feelings on people um, changing their sex, transsexuals, I mean, I completely understand you and, and I will respect you all to the point or to 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 a point, but um, sometimes I think some people go, you know, do it for the wrong reasons, um, and also if every transsexual is going to change from male to female and female to male, 
then where does that leave XXYs? Now forget about me as an XXY, but the other XXYs, the, the guys that would say that they are males, right? Or females, right? Uh, let's just stick with Kleinfelter syndrome, seeing that I'm Kleinfelter syndrome, they say, yeah? Um, you know, they, they're gonna stay stick to saying that they're males. Um, but, but really, like, no, now I've forgotten my point. You see, you're gonna have to get with it, guys. It's uh, <clears throat> I've a, I've a bad memory. I always had a bad memory, just to say before I even, you know, before I ever did anything, drug-wise. And by the way, I have hardly done anything drug-wise. I've been trying to keep that under wraps because there's no need putting that out into the to the world, even though there's a hell of a lot of smokers out there, you know, um, including myself. I regret even saying these words, but there is another video where I mentioned that I do smoke joints, and uh, that would be my thing. I'm not a drinker, really, and yeah, I think the the, the world has gone steadily mad for too long now, and it's time to correct it. It's time to really uh, get films like this out into the open. Into, the, into open debate systems and why don't we have more people in normal society debating with each other instead of arguing with each other and then beating the shit out of each other you know why are, isn't there more possibilities to have open debates you know every Sunday or something do you know what I mean uh, you could even do it in the eyes of God in a church if you want but that would put off people who are not into going to church but I think there's not enough debate going on about this, you know, certain things. And, um, and I know, yeah, I was going to say my girlfriend said that uh, she read a review um, about the film Trans America here in Germany. And, and, but it was, I think it was a, re a review that was translated into German because they were basically saying that the Christians and the the I'm not putting you both in the same category, category Christians and, and, and conservatives, but, you know, that type of lifestyle and, and the headset, or mindset, sorry, mindset, um, doesn't allow, generally, uh, you know, intersex types to, um, to coexist with what I just said, the, the other mindset you know um they don't get it they just don't get it and what i want you to try and get is that i was born with an xxy chromo chromosomes i was about to say an extra x chromosome but no i wasn't because i'm not xy with an extra x no i'm xxy full stop and uh so i was born like that and many people are born with different chromosomal structures and some people with different chromosomal structures and with normal I have to go like this again, normal uh, things like XY and XX, okay? Some of them are born um, hermaphrodites I've learned that it's Aphrodites here in Germany, in Deutschland they say Aphrodite not hermaphrodite so you know, and what are we gonna basically, are you are, are all of you um, people with that mindset who are saying whoa weirdos are you basically saying that we should be you know killed or something like you know or not you know that the next babies that are coming in like what you're doing at the moment you should abort them all is that the point there because that's sick and I don't think God would uh, would be asking people to be doing that and to be thinking that Do you know um, so anyway I'll leave this because it's probably I've probably talked for 20 minutes, and if I have, then I can't put it on YouTube, can I? Um, yeah. Uh, I am extremely truthful. I, I don't tell every single truth. Let's say I haven't yet told every single truth. But I but I don't lie, and I haven't... I haven't lied. And... But I... I equally, I haven't... I'm, I'm, I'm slowly oozing out the rest of the truth. Give me time... Um, because I think the truth works. Okay.